The Yautja are an advanced spacefaring alien race who are able to travel to other planets and hunt such exotic species thanks to their fleets of interstellar spaceships. An important detail that, despite featuring in every single Predator movie, isn't something discussed very often. They can vary greatly in design and incorporate advanced technology and weapons. Many also feature their own trophy walls, representing the many life forms the Yautja have encountered across the galaxy. There are two main types, scout ships and mother ships. The scout ships are small spacecraft used to transport and deploy either individual or small numbers of hunters and can carry around half a dozen crew. They are powered by external thrusters and flown by a single pilot. They also have an autopilot feature and can remain in a holding zone until the hunter is ready to be picked up again. Scout ships usually possess a trophy room, a tactical room equipped with holographic devices, a storage room for captive facehuggers, and drop pods to deploy a hunter from orbit. Drop pods are sleek, elongated capsules used to insert individual predators to the surface of a planet, allowing them to reach the surface quickly, often undetected, without the need for the whole ship to set down. Scout ships possess a relatively weak hull, as in AVPR, a single hit from a plasma caster from the inside was able to down the vessel, although the exterior of the ships are more durable, as the same one seen remained mostly intact despite crashing to Earth and did not break apart. The Mothership is a massive long-range mobile base for Yautja hunters and can house an entire clan. These ships are made for long missions and are equipped with hypersleep chambers. They are totally independent craft where a number of scout ships can dock, and they utilise cloaking technology that renders them both visually and sensor invisible, making them virtually impossible to find. Most mother ships also have a trophy case in which its clan's trophies are put on display. Some of the ships hold a captive xenomorph queen, which the Yautja warriors can release in an area for a hunt. They are fully equipped with scout ships and insertion pods, and are also fitted with powerful weapons including a plasma beam powerful enough to punch a hole from orbit down to the crust, and plasma rockets that can down a Conestoga class starship in only a few hits. In Predator 1, the Jungle Hunter is dropped off by a scout ship. This is our first ever look at a Predator ship, and the design has a rounded shape with two engines mounted either side of the fuselage, a vertical stabiliser underneath, and two cannons on the front. It is a grey colour with bronze accents. The ship is equipped with drop pods and is seen jettisoning one containing the Jungle Hunter. In Predator 2, the Lost Tribes ship was hidden inside a sewer drain that ran beneath an apartment block. It had a segmented, asymmetrical design, much like other Yautja technology, and a dark coloration. Inside the ship, the walls are covered in runes, and a trophy case was featured prominently, containing a xenomorph skull. It can house at least 10 predators. In Alien vs Predator, the isolated clan had giant motherships, which are the largest seen on screen so far, and have been used for millennia. They are a metallic colour and have a long, streamlined shape. On each side, they have extendable sections for atmospheric flight, which will then retract for space flight. Despite their size, they are very stealthy with an invisibility cloak and near-silent running engines. They are equipped with a plasma beam and rockets. On each side, there are docking areas for scout ships. An interesting detail to note is that in the movie, the docked ships are the same model as Predator 1. This type was seen deploying the three Youngbloods via drop pod, and then when the Yautja retrieved Scar's body. Was also seen in the Predator Concrete Jungle and Aliens vs Predator video games. A scout ship that detached from the mother ship and crashed in AVP Requiem had three engines and a similar but different shape to the Predator 1 style scout ship and contained captive facehuggers. Wolf's ship was a small, high-speed, single-occupant craft and dropped the Elite to Earth inside a drop pod. In Predators, a ship was seen on the Game Preserve planet. This model had vertical thrusters and belonged to either the Crucified Predator or the Super Predators. The Crucified Classic Predator set it to fly to Earth in exchange for Royce cutting him free, but he was killed by Berserker and the Super Predator leader set it to self-destruct. 
the fugitive predator's ship, also known as the Ark, crashed in Mexico when it was damaged by the pursuing assassin predator ship. Parts of it survived, and the predator technology was recovered by Project Stargazer. This ship could open wormholes to travel vast distances instantly. The assassin predator's ship was larger and more combat capable. It had an energy shield that could deflect incoming projectiles. It was destroyed when one of the loonies jumped into the engine and it went down in a forest. In Prey, the feral predator arrived via a scout ship which dropped him off directly instead of by drop pod. Possibly as this was the 18th century so they may not have been in use yet, or maybe this particular ship just didn't have them. This scout ship had rotating thrusters and was seen to cloak on its departure. Other Yautja ships from the Expanded Universe include the so-called Chicken Ship from Aliens vs Predator 1999, the Royal Ship from Aliens vs Predator 2, the Predator Hunting Ground Ship, the Saucer from Predator The Big Game, the Cold War Ship from Predator Cold War, the Bad Blood Ship from Predator Bad Blood, the Bullet from Predator Nemesis, the Safari Ship from Predator The Pride at Nagasa, the Golden Mothership from Aliens vs Predator War, the Predator Shuttle from Aliens vs Predator War, the Predator Dropship from the first AVP comic, Hook Predator's ship from AVP Thicker Than Blood, the Gotham City ship from Batman vs Predator, the Gotham City Enforcer ship from Batman vs Predator, and the Dog ship from Aliens vs Predator vs The Terminator. So that was all the Predator ship types, make sure you let everyone know what your thoughts are in the comments section and remember to leave a like as well. Then if you want to help support the channel then you can become a member from as little as 1.99. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.